Let's see where is it. Now if I just walked into that door, it would open up because I had those keys. Oh, man, I hit that too set. But you, did you see that? I whacked that I whacked that uh, floor part with a hammer, and the big key came. So, if we go back and look, notice the shop is open again. Ow. Hey, that wasn't very nice. Now, let's see if we can find that treasure chamber again. I wanted the shot at it. This should be the treasure chamber. Now, once again, zot, zot, we got two hammers. And if we got two hammers, that tells us that the the uh, grim that the uh, god of poverty, I will remember it eventually. Oh darn it, is in that one. However, there's a problem. I didn't enter with enough hearts. So I can't open any more doors. Or any more chests. Oh well. I will go back. Aw. I wanted some more. There's the enemy room. I think I'll use it. You haven't noticed the control is much easier on a player in this game? But you know, I've shown you pretty much all of the first uh, stage here. You've seen the enemies. But. Now, oh come on, get down here. As soon as I clear this out, ow, that was brilliant of me. That, wow, even more brilliant. <sighs> get back here. There we go. Now. One room we haven't entered. You notice that chalice came back. Yep. Instead of them just disappearing forever, uh, all the items come back. Now, if you remember, this was with the treasure room, and I have two keys. I will burn one of them now. What do you know? A heart. And a heart. So, unfortunately, this means that he can still be in one of two places. He can be here, or he can be there. So we will pick up all the other stuff and then take our 50-50 gamble. He is not there. So, he was up here. So what do we get? The credit card. What do you know? Haha. -ha. We win that treasure room. And you'll notice, as long as we have keys, we can go back in. However, I don't want to go back in yet. Because I want my key to be used for the shop. Or, well, not for the shop yet, because the shop is open again. Yes, I'm going to abuse this a little bit. Now. I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the video again. 
Yeah, I'm going to pause again. After finding the snakes. Where did all the snakes go? Oh, there. Hey, some healing. Another one of those. Okay, where are the other ones? They're coming from higher now. Oh, good. Yeah, where are they coming from? Over here, huh? Okay. What I'm going to do, if you haven't guessed, is I am going to farm a lot. And I do mean a lot. I'm going to farm and farm and farm until I've gotten everything I can possibly get out of the treasure room, get everything out of the shop. In other words, I will be pretty much stocked up for the end of the game. Well, as much as I can be with this little life bar and no strength. But you've seen the entire stage. So, when I come back, I will be at the end of the stage door, since you've seen it all, and I will have a whole bunch of hearts. I will have, well, I won't have very many hearts, because I need to keep those kind of open. But I will have a whole bunch of keys, I will have the credit card, I will probably have a barrel. Who knows what else I can get in the treasure room if I keep this up, huh? Oh yeah, I'm going to stock up. So I will be back once I have stocked up. In the meantime, eh... Well, it won't be very long for you, but I've got to get prepared. So, be back in a little bit. Alright. Let's readjust the mic here. And the grinding is complete. Notice it won't let me buy anything? Not even health juice. Well, the health juice. Well, it wouldn't let me buy anything because I'm broke, but... 99 hammers, 8 bottles of water... Nine keys. That is pretty much the maximum amount. So. Now, let us go ahead and end the stage. Aw. Can't open up the doors again. Don't need to, but I can't. So, go in here. And the thing about it, it only allows you to get that many points on the stage. 9990. That is the maximum amount of points you can get in this first stage, I believe. It won't let you get any higher because it doesn't want you to fully power up. But just because, I'm going to save. Yes, save. And, hopefully, I've explained everything in enough detail through the first stage that when I come across the new stuff, that's all I'll have to explain. So, this has been the start of Let's Play Kitticaris of Myths and Monsters. Or something akin to that, anyway. Hopefully, see you all back next time for stage 1-2. Until then, take care, everybody. See you later.